Hey y'all, it's Yvette. I am still trying to learn to look over there at the camera. Um, I'm thinking that what I might do is I might get like a different camera and that way I don't have to see myself. If I'm not seeing myself, then I don't have to worry about looking at myself, which is how I make videos. That's how I've made videos for a kajillion years. So, um, <laughs> I'm trying to look right at where the camera is. Uh, but obviously the problem is that, you know, when it's on, when you're turning it in a way that you're making a video for YouTube, the camera is off to the side instead of being in the middle. I, I don't know why I'm explaining this to y'all. So stay tuned after this video because you're going to see me um, making up this cup of coffee with the hot cocoa bear put in it. I, I know, I know it's a hot cocoa bear, but I drink coffee. And so you're going to see how that turns out. So let's go ahead and get started with Vlogmas Day 17. Making sure, yes, it's December 17th, um, Saturday, December 17th. And I, I, I'm sitting here, I'm drinking this coffee because I've already made the video, so I could tell you it's good. And of course, it's got chocolate and marshmallows in it now. And believe it or not, there's really, I mean, I love chocolate, I really do. But now I have to eat an entire piece of chocolate out of here. And I, I'm having to like really psych myself up for it because there's only so much chocolate I can eat. Um, so we're looking for day 17. And there it is down right there. I hope it's little. It looks like it would be little to fit. Oh, it's one of those squares. Oh, for goodness sakes. Okay. Let's see here. Well, all this sugar is going to make me sweat. So I'm going to turn off my, my little heater right now. But there it is. Oops, I keep forgetting. I'm supposed to go right there. Um, and, okay. So we all know it's milk chocolate. I would eat a white chocolate right now as well, but I, I really can't do all the chocolate. This is going to be uh, enough to... Uh-huh. Okay. But that means the coffee is going to have to wait a little bit. It's really good, but it's a lot of chocolate. Because I'm having coffee with chocolate in it. And a square of chocolate. And full disclosure, I might have had some chocolate before. <laughs> I'm done with chocolate for tonight, I can tell you that. Um, okay, so. We'll start with the cotton cuts. I don't remember which one this is. Um... So let's just pull out number 17 and we'll figure it out. It's a surprise, surprise. Okay. There is number 17. And here we go. Today is a good day for a good day. Okay. Okay. <laughs> okay, so this is the Quilters Cotton. And uh, here it is. It is like army green with very interesting designs on it. I'm trying to decide, to be honest with you, if I like it or not. I, I actually think that I might like it. I think it's the design that kind of helps it out. Um, normally I would be turned off by the color, but that's why I get this box so that I will be given things that perhaps I wouldn't choose for myself. All right, so that's the first one. And this, of course, would have to be the batik. I feel like I got chocolate all over my lips. Okay, fatigue. <laughs> All right, here we go. Uh, 
Okay, well, you know, they go together. Um, so there it is. I really like it. Um, I like it probably more for the design in it and not necessarily the color. Cause like I said, I just, I don't know. It's just not my color. Um, but I, but I like this fabric. I think it looks pretty good. And then let me, um, hold them up together. I don't know that I would put them in the same quilt together. Maybe I would, um, but see the colors kind of go with each other. So I'm, I'm wondering if they're, they're probably doing that on purpose. Sorry, my nose itches. They're probably doing that on purpose. Um, and I kind of like that. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> All right. So now I have the historical sampler company. <laughs> um, number 17. There it is. Okay. There's number 17. Ooh, it's lumpy. It's something lumpy. Oh my goodness. Okay, so these are little um, uh, clips. What? Why can't I remember the word for this? And then on the back, it just says deco clips. <laughs> So you see, um, like, y'all, there's something wrong. There's something wrong. Why can't I remember what this is called? They're not paper clips. Clothes pins? But they're little clips. And they're Christmas trees. Well, they're trees anyway. They're trees with stars on top. I, I love them. I really, really love them. I just love everything that they're giving us. And I think it's because, you know, even though it's a cross stitch box, you know, probably most of us who get this box have been cross stitching for a really long time and we don't really need all the like accoutrements, right? Like if we get things that maybe we have already have like a million of or something like that. I, this is just me and listen, I, I'm, Maybe I'm in the minority, I don't know. Um, but I really appreciate getting stuff like this. The little things to hang on your gifts whenever you're wrapping them um, that are like handmade. I'm sure that they're made in a company, but you know, it's like they look kind of handmade. They, I like that kind of stuff, I really do. Um, so I really love that. Okay. Here is the Crimson Tate number 17 bag. Okay. <laughs> All right, this one, let me see if there's a selvage that I could share with you guys and that would be a no. <laughs> okay, so uh, here is the first one. Um, I would say that it's like a tan background with some geometric shapes on it. Um, not really my cup of tea, but it's not terrible. And this second one, Morta makes up for it because I think I really love this one. And even though there's not a selvage on it, it reminds me at least um of this cute little fabric and now i'm gonna not remember her name i will go and look it up and put it on the bottom if i don't remember um but i love you know some of her fabrics as well i will put the name down on the bottom i will go and look it up and find it um, because obviously I know who this is and I just can't remember. It's like, it's on the tip of my tongue. It's on the tip of my head. It's on the tip of something and I can't bring it up for whatever reason. Um, but anyways, I really like this one. This one's really cute and you know, it's yellow, which we, we are apparently having this huge conversation right now about Stephanie having 
a whole, whole lot of yellow. <laughs> um, so anyway, that is what I have for today, which is day 17. And I have chosen something that I'm going to give away um, as the giveaway for today. And, oh, I had to move it. Hold on, hold on, where did I put it? There it is. Okay. It's a two piece prize and I'm looking at the wrong part of the camera, sorry. Um, I personally love binding babies. I have a bunch of them actually. And I've decided that I would like to try to pull one of you guys over into my, uh, what I love about them. So this is a base and they have a little, um, dowel piece that goes in there. Um, and, they, and you lay this down and the dowel sticks up. And then I, I got one that's a, oh, come on, turn to the front, turn to the front. Oh, there he is. I got the snowman one for you guys <laughs> since it's winter. And you basically just put the dowel up in here and then you wrap your binding around um, the bottom of the snowman and you pull it as you are putting your binding on your quilt. It's just super adorable and I love it. So this is what I'm giving away today. Um, so go ahead and leave a comment down below and um, perhaps you can tell me what you're going to be doing for Christmas. What are your plans? And um, right after this, I am going to have the video of me making a special cup of coffee with my hot cocoa polar bear. So I'll see you guys tomorrow in day 18 video and I hope you have a very lovely evening. Mwah. Okay, so there's my hot cocoa polar bear, but I'm gonna put it in a cup of coffee because I'm crazy like that. Uh, so I'm basically making myself a mocha. And I thought I would show you guys how it's gonna work. So let me, okay, I'm getting this open. Boop, I'm opening it. Right. There it is inside. Now on the on the side here it says uh, rich and sweet, warm and cozy. Trader Joe's hot cocoa polar bear is as cute as it is delicious. A mug of hot milk or your favorite alternative, coffee. A spoon and a bit of stirring results in a steamy, dreamy cup of cocoa for a chilly winter's day. And it says white and milk chocolate confection filled with milk chocolate drops and marshmallows. All right, so basically you would be putting this in milk or a non-dairy beverage um, that is warmed up. But I'm putting it in coffee. Now I have a creamer warmer and I did make creamer because I'm gonna, I'm still putting my creamer in there. I mean, call me crazy, but that's what I'm gonna do. Okay, so I'm using my big cup because I wanna make sure that it's gonna fit in there. And I'm gonna put my creamer in. All right. And stir this up first just to get that all nice and mixed. Here we go. There's the little bear. Jelly Bean is checking it out. He doesn't understand. He's like, I don't know what's going on around here. All right. You guys ready? Here he goes. Oh. All right. I don't know if I can. Wait, let me try to. Make it so you see this better. Um, hold on, I may have to move this part. Ah, okay. Oh, that didn't work. All right, so I'm gonna have to tip it a little bit. So, I'm just gonna keep pushing him down. Ooh, 
Oh, he's melting. Oh, he melted a lot. He's he's like, oh my goodness. Okay. So now I can see. Okay, hold on. Maybe I can just hold. Of course, this is if I start making anybody sick, I'm, I'm apologize. Oh, so it's completely melted in there. And there's some marshmallows. It is completely melted. Like, it is gone. All right. So, one moment. That's smudgy. Oop. <laughs> what you think, smudgy? Okay. Here we go. It's so good. Okay, I can see how this would be a really good cup of cocoa as well, like if you're a cocoa lover. I like coffee. Mm. I can tell you, it's really good in coffee. You just clawed me, buddy. Oh, he's saying he's coming over. Sammy, what do you think, babe? Do you want to see? Oh. Hi. Hi. I was hoping she would come over so y'all could see three cats today. And I don't know where Scout is. They just had a snack, so they're, um, they're done. I have no idea why I'm whispering as if I live in a, a library, but let's have a little more of this. Especially when it comes to your coffee cup. Just saying. <laughs>